The National Museum and Art Gallery are playing their part in Carafesta celebrations, coordinating the art exhibitions at various venues. TTT News team of Ian Wayson and Rajnath Lal added the museum to added the museum, museum and Castle Kalani on their stops on Sunday. El Castle Kalani displayed local icons. The museum in Port of Spain displayed the pieces from across the Caribbean. According to curator Lorraine Johnson, the display is not quite complete. We have about 10 or 11 countries on display here and I'll whisper to you that about three of them are still outstanding. So we got a really good response from the region this year in participating with their visual arts. Ms. Johnson explained it was a huge undertaking and took long nights to make the exhibitions a success. It is a, a good bit of work to do. Um, it encouraged a lot of cooperation among the regional cultural practitioners. We started off with a simple form because I like information. I'm a wordsmith. So we wanted names, list titles of paintings, headshots of the artists, bios of the artists, all of that. Coordinating the activities and organizing the exhibitions are a huge task, but it's easy when you have good staff support. I couldn't have done it without them. I mean, we left here three, four o'clock this morning and I was to install this show. The night before we left one, two o'clock in the morning installing the shoes next door at Napa. You know, I want to give a special mention to Castle Kalani. The museum is coordinating the art exhibitions for Cari Festa 2019. Ian Wason, TTT News. And Ian Wayson continued his Carafesta art tour and adventure with a visit to Castle Kalani, formerly known as Tolmai's Castle. Let us see what interesting he found there. Apart from the song and dance at the Carifesta, there are other activities during the celebrations. And at the Castle Kelani, also known as the Stolmeyer's Castle, there's the iconic arts exhibition. And of course, we are going to see some of the wonderful pieces done by local arts icons. The paintings, all local, featured icons in the art fraternity, including Bosco Holder, older brother of Hollywood actor and dancer Jeffrey Holder. The work of Sibyl Atek was also put on display. She is celebrated as Trinidad and Tobago's first outstanding female painter and was a founding member of the Trinidad and Tobago Art Society. Hugh Stolmeyer, brother of former West Indies Test cricketer and past president Jeffrey Stolmeyer, was also put on display. The viewers were given an added bonus as Dominic took us for a short tour of Castle Kilani, as well as informative discussions. The art exhibition will run during the duration of the Carifesta. Ian Wayson, TTT News.